Hello. Today we are going to do word problem on addition and subtraction. We are going to do a couple types of different word problems. The first one is called part whole. The word problem is John has twenty four marbles and Jack has thirty five marbles. How many marbles do they have together? We can use a bar to illustrate this question. John has twenty four marbles and Jack has thirty five marbles. We need to find out how many marbles they have together. So from here, we know that this is an addition problem. So twenty four plus thirty five equals fifty nine. They have fifty nine marbles together. Now let's do another example. The example is John has. Fifty-six red and green marbles. Twenty-five of them are red. How many green marbles does John have? So, the whole is fifty-six, and part of them is twenty-five. We need to figure out how many are green. We need to figure out this question mark here. From here, we know that this is a subtraction problem. Fifty-six minus twenty-five equals thirty-one. John has thirty-one green marbles. Now let's do the second type called adding on and taking away. John has thirty-five marbles. Jack. Gives him twenty-two marbles. How many marbles does John have now? So John has thirty-five marbles earlier, and Jack gives him another twenty-two marbles. The question is, how many marbles does John have now? So this is an. Addition problem. Thirty-five plus twenty-two equals fifty-seven. So John has fifty-seven marbles now. Now let's do another example. The example is John has eighty-seven candies. He gives Jack forty candies. How many candies does he have now? So we use the bar. In total, he had eighty-seven candies, and now he gives forty candies to Jack. And how many does he have now? So from here. We know that we're taking forty away from eighty-seven, so this is a subtraction problem. Eighty-seven minus forty equals forty-seven. John has forty-seven candies now. Now let's do the last type called comparing. John has fifty-six storybooks. Jack has eighteen more storybooks. How many storybooks does Jack have? So we know that John has fifty-six storybooks, and Jack has eighteen more storybooks. So we know that this is an addition problem. Fifty-six plus eighteen is the total number of storybooks Jack has, which is seventy-four. So Jack has seventy-four storybooks. 
Now let's do another example. John has seventy-nine stamps. Jack has twenty-three fewer stamps than John. How many stamps does Jack have? So, John has seventy-nine stamps, and Jack has twenty-three fewer stamps. We need to figure out how many stamps Jack has, which is this question mark right here. From here, we know that this is a subtraction problem. Seventy-nine minus twenty-three equals fifty-six. So Jack has fifty-six stamps. If you like me, please. Subscribe, like, and share. Thanks for your support.